Hello, oh, Amy. Hi. I'm glad we had this opportunity to sit and chat and to uh, talk about uh, the creation care team and, and what we have in mind. Yeah. I think this is a great thing for us to do. Yeah, definitely. So I guess um, I was wondering, like, how exactly would you describe the creation care like committee and the what exactly like you do? I look upon most of the things that I undertake on behalf of the church as a ministry. So I look upon this as an invitation the bishop offered for me to facilitate, um, you know, a ministry in the diocese. My first thought is to how one prepares to look at creation care and stewardship is to appoint a team. So we've, we have four people on our team, uh, the two of us, uh, Canon Amber Tremblers and David Morgan. And, um, I think that, uh, what we're about really is to create some intentionality. And the idea is that we would like to um, raise the conversation to see where we are around how we understand creation as, um, as, as a gift and how we care for it as stewards. And so the question is, how does our lifestyle reflecting our faith in Jesus Christ offer us the opportunity to live responsibly. And what we what we understand is that many people are already living uh, uh, wonderfully uh, disciplined lives around stewardship. The people are very conscientious about, uh, you know, caring for the earth and the earth's resources and so forth. So I think the creation care team is just trying to um, begin that conversation uh, intentionally. Uh, throughout the diocese. I guess the, the question then is sort of how do you sort of, you and like the, the team itself, like how we like go about um, sharing that with people? That's a big challenge because we have a big diocese. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the team would like to have a discussion with as many people as possible. Uh, we really feel that discussion is, is part of the uh, the growth and understanding of what we're about in terms of creation care. And we also know that many people who are involved in conscientious living around creation care want to talk about that. They want People want to share what they're doing and how they're living uh, because they feel that they're making a difference mm -hmm. in their part of the world. And that's creating a difference in every other part of the world. The team has... Um, I thought that what we would do is we would launch a newsletter. Uh, we call it New Leaf. And we thought that this publication would be an opportunity to, um, you know, uh, offer information and ideas and discussion and also receive um, ideas and discussion. So we are asking parishes in our newsletter uh, to let us know, um, you know, how they may have a story that could be significant to share with others, to allow us to have ideas as to how we might become more uh, intentional in the ways we care for the earth. So um, we thought that this newsletter would be an excellent way to start. And we're really pleased with our first edition, which we launched in July. We're looking forward to our next edition in, I guess, probably around the end of October. Yes, hopefully. But we, we don't think that's really enough. Mm -hmm. We thought we may need to go looking for an um a means and a way to gather information from individuals. So what we're doing is um, we've decided to prepare a survey as we gather more information about where we are locally, how we are locally, uh, how we are living locally, and um, what types of practices we have in our lives right now, which reflect our faith uh, in creation care. The survey information is really like valuable, like moving forward for us specifically, because um we're gonna, you know, take all that information and base our um like future plans around stuff like that. But we're not just interested in in giving people information. Like we uh, during the season of creation, which was September 30th to October 4th, we provide people with information around liturgy, worship, and lifestyles. We um uh, sent out information uh, and pointed people to where they may find information if they're looking for it. You know, although we're providing, providing that information, 
we want to hear from people to find out uh, where they are. So, so the, the, the team, the creation care team, are very interested in having a conversation with as many people as possible. So the survey itself, where would you um, find the survey? Yeah, so what we're going to do is we're going to um, send out the information to the parishes through Synod Office Communication, as we normally do, to inform parishes that we have officially launched our survey. We're going to inform the parishes uh, if they want to publish in their bulletins and on their website and Facebook pages how people can access the survey which I presume will be on our diocesan website. Uh, and uh, we will provide a link for people to uh, engage in that. We want them, we really want people to take time to read over the introduction and to complete the survey. And it, it's very important uh, you complete it because if you if you, you know, leave before you complete it, it, it won't be submitted. Yeah. So we really would like for people to take time to do that. And um, it's not a, a lengthy piece. So our survey is an attempt to capture some of that information uh, as part of the conversation. And I think the intention of the team is to take the results of the survey to form some of the work we might do in the months to come. Yeah. So in yeah, many ways, yeah. the, survey, the response to the survey in the newsletter may actually set our mandate. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, it's it's uh, important to like know uh, our audience going forward, especially. Yeah, well, we're under the assumption that there's already some wonderful things happening. We're, we're under the assumption. Oh, there that definitely not only... is. Yeah. Yes. It's just Absolutely. Uh, part of our job is yep. to look for it. Yeah, right, right. Um, is there, a, do you have any last uh, remarks or anything? I just wanted people to know that this is not new, what we're mm -hmm. doing. What we're attempting to do is not new, but we're, we're, we want to kind of become intentional about it. And also to acknowledge that People have already been doing things and we'd like to hear that. And I think even if someone thinks they're doing something very small and minuscule, that's an important part of our whole story, as, as big or small as our undertakings may be. Um, everybody, everybody can have a part to play and everybody may choose to, to be a part of a conscientious um, effort towards creation care. Thank you for this opportunity, Amy. Yes, thank you. It's good. Nice to talk. Yeah, I look, I look forward to completing the survey now. Yeah. <laughs>